Greetings and welcome fellow Dragon Knights to another episode of Let's Play Divinity 2. Alright, so we have the potion that can help. And now I just need to find Jagon and I can finish this. Uh, let's see. Gondolf, Jack, Tiki. <laughs> this looks on them sick as faces. <laughs> Embarrassing situation it was. Had it coming, drunken fools. Only drunken fools here now were us. <laughs> the Black Boar's favorite customer. What can I do you for? Hmm. So shouldn't the inn be renamed after my hunting trophy now? I could call it the Black Ring Demon Inn, but I fear I'd lose my clientele. Yeah, that's a good point. Of course. Yes, not really got anything of use for me. What do you want of me? I suppose you. All right. Well. He isn't very keen on trading with me, but that's fine. Don't, I don't think he has gotten much of use, although... Um, I suppose this helmet wouldn't be too bad, but it's it's woefully out of date. Eh, never mind. All right. Ah, Rothman. It's been a while. Yes, and you won't believe what I've been through. Another one of your tall tales is in the offing, I see. No, I'm serious. I I'll tell you all about it soon. Well, it's nice to know that I helped someone along the way. I suppose. Alright, let's see. Let's head over to the quarry shrine. I think... I think I want the quest over here for a bit more. See if I remember this right. Yo, quickly, get away from the mine. The mine is overrun, and my secret pension is gone. Unless they don't find the hidden wall in the little office, then oh, no, I must flee, or I'll die here. What the devil is going on here? We're blowing up the gate. No move. And he shall find a sigil for the damned one. And now you insolent imbeciles will feel the wrath of the ring. Divine have mercy on us. The black ring are everywhere. Get out of here if you value your life. No mere human stands a chance against these fiends from the pit. Hold on, what if I want to enter the mine? Are you crazy with those dark troops and demons in there? Besides, we blew up the entrance. There must be another way in. I do not know. Though Guildmaster Williams might. The lassie was in the main building when we were attacked, and most likely is dead by now. Do what you will. And if you can save Williams, so much the better. But don't come haunting me afterwards, claiming I didn't warn you. 
Now, I'm out of here and I won't stop running until I find a champion garrison or something. Good luck to you. All right, well, he's sensible enough, I suppose, but... Yeah, he, she does have a point. Which is kind of was I, why I was afraid of going in there. Well, we can come back here later. And listen to some nice, soothing music. I travel past the points where I already was. I could probably have teleported over to the right shrine, but you know, didn't. So. Oh. Let's just speed through this again. Yo, quickly! The mine is open. Unless I don't find the hidden. We're blowing. Commander Baal is here, and he shall find a sigil for the damned one. And now you insolent imbeciles will feel the wrath of the ring. Divine have mercy on us, the Black Ringer... Get out of here if you value your life! Are you crazy? I do not know. Do what you will. No, I'm out of here. <sighs> Why are demons always called Baal? I mean, really, are they so uncreative with their naming schemes? There's always a ball in there. Ah, oh, well. Let's just hope the music returns and we can focus on some positive questing experience again. Fine, relaxed. Oceans throughout the countryside. Killing bandits and black ring as we go. You're listening to Divinity of M with your host Leo M Panther. Oh, I have been both killing scum since the day he could hold the mouse. I'll find a cure. This poison is killing me. I don't know if actually it would be good in a radio career. It's something my father and brother have done, but I'd never really tried for it myself. I don't think I'd really fit in, a, in, in that kind of environment. Well, this is an interesting place. A traveler who actually stops and takes the time to look at this magnificent structure. How refreshing. The Gremory family jewels are safe in the Orobas fields. The Wyverns will protect them for us, and who ventures into their nests anyway? They are of no interest to most. 
No, the merchants think only of gold and the soldiers only of liquor. Well, yeah. They don't realize that the site they so heedlessly cross dates back to days when mankind was but in its infancy. Hmm. How come you know so much about this place? I'm an archaeologist. I'm afraid my knowledge of these stones is more limited than I should like. The symbols carved into the slabs are of a variety too ancient to be deciphered without reference. I'm sorry to say the exact purpose of this circle will remain a mystery to me. Hmm. Perhaps I can be of help to you. I'd love to be able to read these inscriptions, but unless you speak ancient draconian, I don't think you can aid me. Though, should you meet a 10,000 year old who still speaks the language, you can ask him. <laughs> Safe travels. Hmm. Well, we have not seen, we have seen stranger things. And since there are plenty of ghosts about, there's bound to be someone who can speak that language. Although, of course, where they are, I don't know. Alright. Let's see if we can undo this properly. Killing me. Hmm. Ah, oh, damn it, my creature died. Oh well. Nothing hidden up here. I mean, this is part of the reason why I really feel I should start upgrading my vitality. Aside from my uh, general ability to fight. Hmm. An, an, an anonymous limerick, alright. What is glowing then? The Tegos' axe. Let's have a look at that. Alright, the anonymous limerick. A quest item? No. You want to travel through Broken Valley? Then draw your weapon and do not dally. Fairy Troll and Goblin Rage ever evade the Rhyming Mage, or I'll can guarantee you a bloody finale. Alright, that works. Sort of. Alright, and the axe. Um, got no enchantments. If, as you fear, the little axes carved into the haft of this axe indicates the number of people Tegos has killed, he's not just a bandit, but a mass murderer. Hmm. And why would he leave his axe behind? Well, most likely it was by accident, not on purpose. Alright, let's bring Arise, my beast back. Alright, this is not one of those waterfalls that has a cave hidden underneath. Nope. Alright, it looks like more bandits or black ring perhaps. I'm pretty sure I can't swim that well, so let's not risk it. I mean, I'll probably survive, but I don't think going into the water here actually will help me. So let's just cross the bridge. Yeah, I do have some money still. Let's just cross the bridge and see what happens. Oh, 
Well, nothing happens. Must be a different bridge then. Let's... Yeah, I think these these wooden emplacements are just here to make sure I can get out of the water if I want to. Uh, let's carve our way towards that stone thing we saw. Yeah, black green soldiers. This is a little bit annoying. Enemies are just a little bit too weak for me to use fatality on it. Is nigh. You are so close to your goal. Too bad I chose to feed you to a troll. You know you're not endearing way yourself to me, Belagar. Well, I've already fought a troll, so how hard can this one be? <laughs> Never mind. I think I know where it is. Uh, anything over here, though? I'll take the black rose, that's always good. Right. Um, this leads out of the Broken Valley to the Orobas Fjords. We don't want to go there. Or more specifically, we don't need to go there just yet. Going to the Orobas Fjords is something you do when you're done with everything else in Broken Valley. Because there's nothing left to do here. And you have to move on, but... Partially it's also because the main quest requires that I go to the Orobas fields to uh, retrieve something. Uh, what exactly I need to retrieve I don't remember, doesn't matter. Because the game will tell me when the time is right. As I currently still miss much of the stuff I need to actually be considered a dragon knight. <laughs> My wrath. Yeah, fatality. <laughs> Seems like a bit of a waste on these enemies, but I guess it works. Um, then I think this is just for me so I can get out of the water if I need to. We've almost circled back to where we were before, because... Yeah, we're almost to where that fortune teller is. And I see some more goblins. Creatures from this broken dale! Fear now all my magic gale! And know the greatest mage by far is the mighty Belaga! Ah! 
All right, let's deal with this first then. Balagar isn't actually level one. <laughs> Do not attempt to kill Balagar. That is just foolish. Sorcery by amateurs is often tragic. They have no clue how to properly use magic. Fire, storm, and deadly blast. That, my friend, is how you cast. Balagar. No one so erratic should be so powerful. I agree. Let's travel to the Maxos Temple before we meet him and his devil tree again. I don't think that's our choice, though. Thank you all for watching. See you all next time.